I, I guess I, I tell people I come from one island to another. My name is Tim Ogilvie. I'm uh, the new dean of St. George's University School of Veterinary Medicine. I've been dean before. I, I guess I, I tell people I come from one island to another. I come from Prince Edward Island, Canada, which is one of our ten provinces in the country, and it has a university and a school of veterinary medicine. And I have been on faculty there for 25 years or so, and was dean for 10 years at the Atlantic Veterinary College, I'll call it AVC. And in that capacity of dean, I traveled back and forth to St. George's University, came to the clinical meetings, I met Dean Sis at various uh, dean's meetings, and was invited back to provide advice from time to time on, on matters of accreditation, or matters of program, or matters of academia, and I got to know the place. And I, I got to uh, very much enjoy and like and grow to love the place. And so when the opportunity came up to take over from Dean Sis, I thought what a, what a great opportunity to reinvest my energies in leadership in academic veterinary medicine and to follow in the footsteps of somebody who did such a wonderful job and created such a magnificent culture around the School of Veterinary Medicine. So I'm indeed excited to be here. Um, I chose to come because of the opportunity, because I felt I have still something to give back in a, a leadership and an administrative way to academic veterinary medicine. And at this time and in this place, it's a fit for me. My areas of interest uh, as an academician, large animal internal medicine, um, married with a family. I have two sons, uh, both veterinarians. And so they followed in my career. Uh, I should say we have two sons, my wife and I, because when my, in my busy time she of course was doing most of the of the raising of the boys and uh, unbeknownst to me they uh, wanted to get into veterinary medicine or chose that as a career and the oldest son is um, uh, in uh, St. Uh, Andrews, New Brunswick as a fish veterinarian. So there's opportunity in aquaculture and fish health and he is married to a high school sweetheart and has our grandson, Townsend. And Townsend is two years old, so he's the light of our life. And they live in a very picturesque, picturesque part of Canada. And our, my other son is in a residency program in small animal surgery in Guelph, and he's going into private practice this summer. The dean of a, a faculty of veterinary medicine, uh, like the dean of a, a faculty of, of any college or, or professional school, I think is to provide leadership oversight and environmental setting for the institution. And by setting the environment, I mean putting things together and a team together and the way that team works together for the success of the students. It's the love of the place that people like your chancellor have and the leadership has. And in all of my conversations, whether they be formal conversations or just informal sidebar conversations with your chancellor and the administrators that take the lead from him, it's always been an inclusive discussion and the discussion that tells me that everybody here is in it for the right reasons and that starts with the students. And so I, I really, am pleased with that philosophy, so I feel comfortable in joining the institution.